I'm going through pain. I've been up for the last 24 hours. It's been 24 Been up all night searching. I hadn't had nothing to eat, nothing to drink. I ain't going to stop until it's over with. Until she come home, until she in her own. That's all I want. That's all I ask for. Well, those are comments from uh, Hawaii Robinson's father just two weeks ago, 24 hours after his daughter's disappearance. Authorities won't say if Robinson is a suspect or a person of interest in the investigation. Mobile District Attorney Ashley Rich held a news conference today to dispel rumors surrounding the investigation. Local 15's Christian Jennings was at the conference. She joins us at Government Plaza with more. Christian? Well, it was actually a very short press conference, Kim. The DA only answered a couple of questions from reporters, and her answers were very vague, saying the same thing we've been hearing for the past two weeks, that she isn't commenting on any specifics right in the middle of the investigation. There are no arrests that are being made. We have merely, as part of the investigation uh, into this case, into the death of Hawaii Robinson, executed two search warrants, which is standard procedure in any investigation. That procedure included investigators walking out with items from both Hiawatha Robinson's home in Pritchard and his girlfriend, Tasha Parker's home in Sims. I really am not going to comment on any of the uh, specifics of the investigation. This is very much an ongoing investigation um, being worked daily by the members of the FBI, the ABI, my office, and the Pritchard Police Department. On Monday, word of a possible arrest spread quickly on social media, sparking a huge gathering at the jail. For safety reasons, officials don't want that happening again. They say no arrests are planned for today. I would say to the community, let's, let's be patient. Let's let them do their jobs. When they bring um, a suspect or arrest somebody, we want that conviction to stick. Now, again, officials are not saying whether Hawaii's father or his girlfriend are suspects in this case. But I can tell you, after doing some research today, that Hawatha Robinson does have an arrest record, an arrest history here in Mobile County. According to DA Ashley Rich, Robinson actually has several domestic violence cases on record, but most of them never went forward with prosecution. However, one of them in 2004, in one case, Robinson did plead guilty to domestic violence third degree. Reporting live outside Government Plaza tonight, I'm Christian Jennings, Local 15 News.